Hello, oh, Twitter. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Open Vision Final Fantasy Brave Express Global Force Animator live stream. Yay. <laughs> I'm Hirok. I'm the producer of World of Vision Final Fantasy Brave Express Global. Hi everyone, I'm Nanami. I'm a uh, World of Vision Final Fantasy Brave Exit Global version. And hello everybody, my name is Justin. I am the community manager. Nice to see everybody. Hello, hello. Hi. So, you are going Hi. Ano, sumasen, mata, so, kaishi ga okurete shimatte, taihen, moshake, gozaimasen. First of all, please accept our sincere apologies for、um, our delay in starting this live stream. いろいろちょっとね、あの機材の調整等に時間がかかってしまい、あの遅れてしまいました。申し訳ないです。Uh, once again, we did have a bit of a technical difficulty in、uh, starting the stream. So again,、um, thank you very much for your patience. はい、というわけでですね、えー、皆さん、まずはこのグローバルアップ4周年を迎えました。So first off, we would like to announce that the global app is celebrating its fourth anniversary. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 本当にね、この4周年を迎えられたというのは、本当にね、あのプレイヤーの皆さんのおかげです。本当にありがとうございます。This is all, we've been able to reach this milestone all because of your support from all the players. So, once again, thank you so much for that. はい。でね、あの本日はね、このまあ今映っている3人で、えー、盛り上げていくんですが、まあ、さらにですね、スペシャルゲストとして、えー、アナスト三章のシナリオ制作秘話について、このスペシャルゲストを呼んでですね、語ってもらおうと思っております。So we are very much thrilled to bring an exciting, exciting live stream with these、uh, members that you see on the screen right now. But there's actually more.、Uh, we'll have a special guest appearance and we'll talk about the behind the scenes in creating the scenario for another story, chapter three, that's currently ongoing. So do、uh, stay with us until the very end of the stream once again. まあね、あの今このね、あの画面見てもらってわかる通り、不自然にこっちの方がなんか空いてるでしょ。そこに誰か来る予定です。You do realize that,、um, you know, right beside Nanamiya, we do have a bit of a gap right there as if there's someone who's like, as if it's a spot for someone to come in. So,、um, yeah,、um, that's what it is. Hi. So, the Dai Hon Nai Kotu, the interpreter, come out to us. And I just traveled the interpreter for、um, just doing something off the script. So, the interpreter will、um, make you. It's all right. はい、というわけでね、じゃあ、ななみ、あの、早速ね、あの、今日の、あの、放送の内容の紹介をお願いいたします。So, without further ado, uh, Nanami, let's have you introduce the live stream contents for today. All right, you leave it to me. I'm sure you're very anxious to know about what's coming in our global app fourth anniversary live stream.、Uh, so, let's get into it. <laughs> First of all, it's latest update information part one. And the behind the scenes of scenario creation for another story, chapter three, and latest update information, part two, and fourth anniversary design content recap, and mini game challenge, and then future roadmap. That's it. Now, before we get into the latest update information, part one, that we are all anxious to hear about, let me introduce a campaign we will be running for this live stream. If the total number of views of the live stream in its archive exceed 5,000 as of March 31st, a special wallpaper for PC will be gifted. We would like, like to have as many viewers as possible, so we urge everyone who is watching this live stream right now to share this stream to your friends.、Mm. So, without further ado, let's talk about the first item in the lineup. Latest update information part one. Hiroki san, please take away. Yes,、yeah, sure. So, first, please take a look at this video. イエーイ<笑>というわけでね、はい、皆さん、えー、まずはね、アナスト三章の新キャラ、えー、軍師オルドアが4月1日から登場いたします。All right, so first, a new character from another story, chapter three, strategist オルドア will be available starting April 1st. 皆さん、どうですか ?So, how was it for everyone? 
。ちょっとコメントをね、ちょっと見てみたいと思います。Uh, just gonna take a moment to have a look at the comments. <笑> I think everybody excited about new Ozoa costume? Yes. うんうん。Yes, indeed. She looks very nice. <笑>オドアちゃん。オルダちゃん。<笑><笑><笑>はい<笑>ね、じゃあね、じゃあ早速ね、あ皆さん本当あのコメントありがとうございます。ぜひね、こういう形で生放送なんで、どんどんコメントください。So thank you very much、uh, for your、uh, exciting comments.、Um, we're happy to see that and、uh, keep them coming because it is indeed a live stream that、uh, <笑> so yes, do keep them coming. はい。じゃあジャスティン、早速ね、あの今回のオルダーの、ね、詳細情報お願いします。All right then, Justin, let's hear about the details about this new old one.All right, perfect. Let's dive in and let's take a look here. So, as you guys saw, we have Old Doa coming out, Strategist Old Doa. She is a cost 100 unit, and she is、uh, Ice type. And her weapon type is Staff, which is for Black Mages, etc. And her main job is Ashen Strategist. So, a little bit about this job here. So, it is a Vanguard physical tank class. It is a job with a variety of ways to defend against enemy attacks, such as bestowing courage. Protect shell and barrier on itself or reducing physical damage taken by surrounding allies. So, very powerful, very good here. But you guys saw the limit verse already, so let's go take a look at it again while I explain a little bit of information about it. So, we've got her limit verse Jaws of the Serpent. So, this removes all buffs from the target within range and then deals large damage based on the caster's magic stat and absorbs a portion of the damage dealt. And raise his own all attack resistance for three turns. Good, pretty good. Next up, we've got Scapegoat Counter Offensive. This is an EX ability. This bestows a barrier on itself that reduces damage three times and increases the chance of being targeted and bestows a physical damage reduction to allies within an area around self.、Um, and it is a diamond shaped ability with a range of four and a range of height of one. In four turns and bestows CT down nullify for four turns and bestows re raise removal to successful attacks for four turns. So there's a lot going on there.、Um, and the physical damage reduction CT down nullify and re raise removal to successful attacks applies to all allies within the area around Odola and not just Odola herself. Very good, very good. All right, moving on here, we've got Mad Pillar Stratagem. Uh, this deals large damage up to two targets based on the caster's magic stat and inflicts a damage reduction effect for three turns and a chance of infusion for three turns. All right, there was a lot of information there. Usually、uh, it's not quite so much. But anyway,、uh, moving on here, a little bit more simple. We've got her weapon coming up. We've got a staff here,、um, and this is going to provide healing power up. And this is the Sage's Crimson Plume. Um, and this is going to be,、uh, or the limited additional abilities are for ice, water units only, and it provides area attack resistance up, magic attack resistance up, and magic attack resist piercing rate. So, yeah, a lot of great stuff. Oldoa is going to be very strong, and I'm sure we'll be seeing her around the continent of Ardra pretty soon.、But、yeah. Ah, yeah. yeah, Justin, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Justin, thank you. はい、ね、あのクリスタルの戦士から始まるね、アナザーストーリーの物語は、このプレイヤーの皆さんからのご興奮もあってですね、えー、これまで、えー、第3章まで続くことになりました。So, thank you once again, Justin.、Um, the tale of another story, which began with the Warriors of the Crystals, has continued for three chapters, and this is all because of how well received it was from, from all of you, the players. はい、でもね、でそしてですね、まあ、現在ね、第3章のストーリーもまあ後半に突入していて、ね、物語の真実にだんだん近づいてきてますね。And now the current chapter 3 has proceeded to the latter half and it is nearing the truth of this tale. はい、ということで、皆さん、その、きっとね、アナザーストーリーの物語、どういう,どう,いう形でこう生まれたのかっていうのに、まあ、興味はあるんじゃないですか So, with all this said, I'm sure some of,、um, a lot of you are wondering about things like,、um, how did this narrative of another story come about? ということで、そこでですね、まあ、本日はこのアナザーストーリーを作った開発チームのメンバーを呼びました。えー、ストーリーの制作秘話とか、あとアナスト3章に登場した、ね、キャラクターの設定などを、ちょっとね、ここで話してもらいたいなと
思っています。So today we actually invited a member from our development team who is responsible for creating another story and would like them to talk about the behind the scenes and also the setup of、uh, the characters who appeared in、uh, chapter three. Hi. Now let's bring him in. I would like to introduce Ko Noguchi, the l e a d scenario planner. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> おいそうねはいえー、ご紹介に上がりました、えー、リードシナリオプランナーの野口と申します。本日はよろしくお願いします。So, hello everyone.、Um, as I've been introduced,、um, I'm Noguchi, the lead scenario planner.、Uh, thank you very much for having me today. Yay. Yay. <laughs>、uh, yeah, so Noguchi san actually joined us for a Justin and Friends stream yeah, yeah.、Uh, last year in LA after the fan event.、Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice to have you back on the stream. Thank you for coming. <笑>はい、えーまあ、当時は確かアナザーストーリー2章のお話をさせていただいたかと思うんですけど、まあ、その後ジャスティン・フレンズにもお邪魔させていただいて、うんまあ、日本のお土産としておみくじを私にしていたかなと思います。<笑><笑>はい Yeah,、um, I think back then、uh, I was、uh, talking a bit about、um, another story, chapter three. And、um, it's, well, it was probably after that that I was able to join Justin for that, Justin and Friends at that time. And、um, I still remember that I brought、um, some Omikuji fortune telling for、uh, Justin as a souvenir at that time. <laughs> okay, for some of you, the live stream might be the first time that you were seeing Noguchi san. So can we ask you to introduce yourself once more? Hi, I'm a little bit. えー、改めまして、FFB 現役戦争の、えー、シナリオ、世界観を担当させていただいております、えー、スケンクスノグチです。で、えっと、じゃあ何やってんのかっていう話なんですけど、まあ、シナリオを作っているだけじゃなくて、まあ、その世界観っていうところで言うと、まあ、リミットバースト、まあ、どんなものにしようかとか、ビジョンカードをどんな絵柄にしようかとか、まあ、あとはあのボイス収録の時に、まあ、こういう演技してくださいみたいな。話だったりとか、まあ、の結構まあ細かいところを挙げるとたくさんあるんですけど、<笑>まあざっくりそんな感じでいろいろあの携わらせていただいております。So, yes,、uh, once again, I am the, the, in the、uh, scenario, production, scenario production leader for, the, for、uh, World of Visions, by,、uh, World of Visions um, uh, from Square Enix.、Um, and、um, when I, so, So, you might be wondering, what exactly do I do when I say、um, I construct the world universe and such? So, when we say the world universe,、uh, when we say the story universe,、um, it's not just about the scenario, but also about how do we construct the limit burst,、um, the vision cards, and also、um, about the costumes for each of the characters. And also, I do a bit of the voice directing,、um, telling, telling the actors、um, how I would like for them to、uh, portray the characters, and many other small things here and there. But,、um, Simply put, those would be what I'm responsible for. I'm going to say that the world is the world of the world. Yes, indeed. So,、um, when it comes down to constructing the world universe for World of Visions, he is indeed the central figure. Right, thank you, Noguchi san. Let's move on to the next section. Behind the scenes of the scenario, another story editions. Yeah. In this, in this section, we would like to deep dive into the detail around the currently ongoing another story chapter three. We have prepared some questions for Noguchi san that we would like to him,、uh, we would like him to answer. But before that, please note that this section may contain spoilers for those players who have. Not playing another story chapter three. Just to say, is everyone good to go? まあ多分ね、この放送を見ていて、あの、まあ、ここまだやってないって人は、まあ、いないんじゃないかなと思いますよね。I mean, if you're watching the live stream right now, I would expect that,、um, you know, I'm sure you have played, you, know, you have or have been playing、uh, chapter three, right? <laughs> right? <laughs> I would hope so, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right, it looks like we're good, I think. So, I think so let's, just, <laughs> let's have a next slide, please. So, these are introductions. I will read out synopsis right now. So, introduction, world, 
ravages Adra once again. Responsible for the new nightmare is the Ashen King,、mm. who has turned Adra into a continent of the death and destruction. The eight warriors of the crystal descended onto Adra to stop the Ashen King, but with their connection to the core crystal sphere, the trial they face only continued to amount. Okay, for another story, chapter three. What drew everyone's attention the most was probably the mysterious army and the appearance of Ashen King. まあね、確かにね、その冒頭のストーリーのところでね、マシュリが海王に敗れるっていうのはちょっとびっくりしましたね。Yes, true.、Um, I mean, seeing Mashuri's defeat against the Ashen King at the beginning of the story was、uh, indeed quite a surprise. <laughs> yes, and I'm sure that it was a surprise to our player too. So then let's get right into the question to f o r Noguchi-san. All right. So. I guess I can start off the questions here. We've got some questions.、Um, all right, so Noguchi san mentioned that another story, chapter one, is the story of Lucio's growth and the warriors of the crystals, and that chapter two is the story of the activities of the warriors of the crystals and the story about wrath.、Um, so then, what is the overall theme for chapter three? Also, in chapter three, we've witnessed the characters in the main story. Not the Warriors of the Crystals appearing in new forms.、Um, how did you go about coming up with the characters' settings? And、um, do you have any interesting behind the scenes stories that you would like to share as well? Justin, you can avoid it. I'm not sure if you can see it. I'm not sure if you can see it. I'm not sure if you can see it. You seem to remember very well. And,、um... Plus, um, well, I mean, you, you know, you're starting off the bat with um,、yes. you know, three questions, and、uh, you seem <laughs> um, you you seem pretty pretty well invested in um <laughs> the stories and such, no? Yeah, then, 早速じゃ野口くんにちょっとぜひ質問回答お願いします。I mean, these are so yeah. Um, I think it's um time for our 野口さんと answer these questions. Then. <laughs> <laughs> はい。えーまず another story の三章なんですけれども、えーまあクリスタルの戦士のお話としてはまあ一つの区切りとして作らさせていただいております。で、まあ、今まで、あの、アナザーストーリーっていうのはメインシナリオとはあまりつながりがない状態で書いてきていたので、まあ、モントとかジェイダンとか出たとしても、まあ、あくまでゲスト的な立ち位置で出ております。Yes, so first of all, another story chapter three is positioned to be a major break for the stories revolving around the Warriors of the Crystals. And until now, there hasn't been much connection between another story、um, with the main scenario. And、um, even if、uh, characters like Mont or Jaden and so on were, were to have appeared in the stories,、uh, they were positioned more or less as a bit of a guest. で、まあ、今回はですね、あのまあ、メインシナリオの展開を前提とした、まあ、原因戦争の世界としてあの、まあ、ちゃんと強く表現していこうというのをまあ一つの目標にしてあの、まあ、メインシナリオのキャラクターというのが、まあ、今回ゲストじゃなくてもうがっつりアナザーストーリーに絡んでくるよという立て付けで作らさせていただいてます。So, this time, our goal was to create a strong connection within the world war of the visions、uh, universe. So, based on, the、uh, based on the development of the main scenario, so、um, characters from the main scenario appeared in the story as the main characters and were very much heavily involved rather than them appearing as、uh, guests. All right, I see.、Um, so, Follow up here.、Um, can I also ask how you chose the character and you know, who would appear and their setting?、Um, for example, like why was Mont the Ashen King? Yes, of course. First of all, I chose Mont to be the boss. Mont is a place where I was in the city. Mont is a place where I was in the city. Mont is a place where I was in the city. Mont is a place where I was in the city. 表現していきたいなとは思っているんですが、まあ、モントというキャラクターはまあメインシナリオの展開上、あまりインの部分を表現できていなかったかなと思っています
Yes, of course, Justin. So uh, the first thing that I actually decided on was to make Mon the big bad boss, so to speak, of this arc. Now, as a principal, when I plot out a character, I always try to express the yin and the yang side of them. But with Mon, um, given how the main pro main scenario was progressing, um, I wasn't able to particularly flesh out the yin or the dark side of him uh, particularly well. Hi, ma. モンとはまっすぐ突き進んでいくキャラクターではあるんですが、まあ、そのモンとの根本にある部分が、まあ、人間に希望を抱いているメインシナリオのモンとと人間に絶望している、まあ、その違いだけでモンとというキャラクターがどこまで行ってしまうのかというところで、まあ、行き着くところまで行ってしまうというのが、まあ、モンとというキャラクターの強さであり、まあ、怖さでもあるのかなと思っています。So, um, that... So this may just have to do with the fact that、um, Mont certainly is a character who is very much single-minded, and he's got he's got that determination for a cause. So I thought then, what happens to Mont's path if we flip his fundamental concept that he has、um, from having hope in mankind, as we saw, as we witnessed in the main scenario, to despairing in mankind? And taking something to the extreme of such is、uh, both Mont's strength and, as well,、um, it's something that would make him a force to be reckoned with. And this Mont is a force to be reckoned with. And this Mont is a force to be reckoned with. And this Mont is a force to be reckoned with. So, with this version of Mont as the core of the story, we chose other characters who could be featured in the story without it feeling contrived. でえっとまあ、アナザーストーリー3章に登場する、まあ、他のキャラクターたちのまあ設定だったり、まあ、コンセプト的なところもお話しさせていただければとは思うんですが、えっとまあ、ちょっと長くなるかもしれないんですが<笑>よろしいでしょうか And、um, having said all this,、um, I would like to further speak upon the concept settings for、um, the character,、um, not just Mont, but、um, all the other appearing characters. But、um, it may end up being a little long, but、um, is everyone going to be okay with that? Yeah, of course. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, we love, love to hear it. It's exciting to hear about what went on the behind the scene in creating the characters. Everyone, if you have any feedback, please feel free to comment in the chat. はい、ではまず、太陽軍側から始めたいと思います。はいえー、ではまず、キトンについてですね。じゃスライドの方を、はい、ありがとうございます。では、キトンについてなんですけれども、あのーまあ、キトンというキャラクターは、まあ、どこまでも、あのーまあ、モントに強い忠誠心を持っていて、まあ、忠誠心だけではないんですが、あのアナザーストーリー3章のモントの、まあ、絶望人間に絶望しているモントにこう一番理解してそばに寄り添っていられるっていうのは、まあ、キトン以外はいないかなっていうのでまずキトンを選びました、まあ、これが仮にマッシュリーとかグラセラだった場合はおそらく殺してでも止めようとすると思っています Okay, then. So let me start with the Ashen King side. So、um, the setting for キトン as we can see here.、Um, so I would think that she would follow Mont to wherever he goes、um, because of her loyalty, and not just because of that, but、um, because of other things too. But in that regard, Kiton is probably the only one who'd be able to do that, and the only one who'd be able to fully understand Mont's despair that, he, that we witnessed in chapter three and would stay by his side until the end. Like, for example, if this were、uh, Mashuri or Gla、uh, Glaciella, then what they would probably do is to、um, do all they can to stop. Even if that meant that he, they had to kill him. はい、では続いて、ボルケですね。スライドの方。Um, um, let's follow that with、uh, Volke then. <笑>はい、えー、では、まあ、今回メインシナリオのまあ延長として描きましょうってなった場合、まあ、モントの一番の剣である、まあ、リリシュがまあ亡くなった後の話になるんで、まあ、それを引き継いでもらうっていうのは、まあ、ボルケが。一番いいんじゃないかなというところで判断しました。で、メインシナリオだと、まあ、モントの姉的なポジションでリリシュを描いている部分はあるんですが、まあ、今回は、まあ、ボルケになった場合は、今度は弟として描いていけるだろうなっていうところは、結構確信めいたものがあったので、あのボルケを選ばせていただきました。
So we were when we were setting up things for Volke, um, and uh, when we were setting up the story background as as an extension of the main scenario, we figured that let's say if uh, Mont's most lo- loyal lieutenant Lilith were to fall, then who would be the one who can carry on that role? That would be Volke. So the logic is that um, if Lilith was um, depicted as an elderly sisterly figure to Mont, then Volke would be portrayed as a younger brotherly figure, and we had very much a confidence around that. And let's have Oldua next. エラビタカッタっていうのがあったんですけど、ま、そもそも海洋軍がま、たった行ったところからじゃああのオルドアがふさわしいんじゃないかっていうところでオルドアが上がってきましたであのまあそれであればまあオルドアはまあ単なる忠義だけでなくやっぱり家族のためにまあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ
in terms of strength after their awakening, Jario happened to be the one who who was the most convincing. And as we mentioned before, uh, as we mentioned at the beginning of the section, um, considering that um, considering Master's fall at the beginning of the story, it felt very natural um, that Dario, as her elder brother, um, he would be the perfect one who would be able to go against Mott. はい。はい。で、えっと、ま、で、え、ま、ダリオもあの出てくることが決まっているので、ま、ダリオを動かしていくうちに、ま、お友達としてというか、仲間としていくにはま、シャドウリンクス以外ありえなかったっていうのもあるし、ま、いろんな理由が重な
Um, so yeah, we're very happy to hear the behind the scenes. So hopefully everybody out there that's interested was taking notes as well. Um, but yeah, there's a lot of details that goes into creating characters. So thank you very much for doing that. It's also very interesting to see all the comments that are coming up from our audience in that uh, <laughs> there um, seems like uh, there's some interesting um, reactions to it too, and um, that's great to know. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I am the one the fan for another story, and I like personally Astrius, um, because he has a a complex story behind in the another story. Like he was a, like professor in the another world, that kind of thing, and also he is very strong unit in the game. So <laughs> yeah, I love Astrius personally. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. So, okay. Next up, I would like to ask Noguchi-san some question. Are you ready? Hi, Hi. Uh, I would like to ask a question about strategist Odoa. As she came at Ashinkin service, her speech her speech seems to change from her usual Odoa ethic. Yes. Hmm way to a much normal one but what was the intention behind it まあ、え、モントがまあ、持っているクリスタルに触れるっていうシーンがあったと思うんですけど、まあ、あれに触れることで、まあ、過去のモントの経験だったり、まあ、知識みたいなものがモルドアの中にま、流れていったっていうことで
、なんかラフが多いとかってありますけど、野口くんどうですかそうですね。じゃあ、スライド先っぽか。Let's go back to the previous slide. はい。はい。じゃあ、えっと、ま、皆さんの思いはなんとなく伝わったんですが。そう。じゃあ、これから回答したいと思います。はい。で、ま、あくまで設定的なお話にはなっちゃうんですけど、ま、あの、魔力量
So the fact that she's actually uh, like her strength is very much comparable to the other um, warriors of the crystals, despite the small amount of magic power that she has, that does mean that uh, she is indeed a, a very strong uh, warrior herself. I think um, that all that's all a result of um of the amount of uh, training she has and she's undergone. Mm, that was very interesting. We never know what's behind the scenes of the characters, <laughs> so that is a big news that um, Ralph is very weakest. Okay, so thank you, Noguchi-san. It's not just as we have question today, but we also asked for a question from our player in advance. So we'll like to pick up a few of them. So we will ask Nogsan this question we picked. So please tell us more of these behind the scenes stories. The first question is, will there be possibility for this story to collide with the main story? Such as Dario, the crystal born scene, Vanilla, or maybe Shadow Link, the crystal born meeting with Kiton. Also, will we ever see anything from Belo or Liat? はい。で、まあ、まず人の縁みたいなものっていうのはまあ、as far as uh, Dario and uh, Venera is concerned, um, so the short answer would be that they would not meet. However, if they were to meet, I'm sure uh, Dario would would probably sense something upon seeing Venera. So this is actually just a personal thought, but um, even if things were to happen in an alternate universe or timeline, I still believe that people would still meet nonetheless, or that um, they would be destined in uh, some way, shape, or form. So. In that regard, uh, when we look at um, Dario and Omachi, um, that's um, their portrayal is um, something that would, that would something that would depict my thought there, and um, the reason being um, we uh, the actually the sorry the reason why we casted the same uh, voice actress uh, for as Venera for Omachi is actually because of this um, to kind of create that connection. えっと、ま、現状のところ登場予定はま、なかったりはするんですが、いうふうに思っ <laughs> So as far as Beilu and Liart is concerned, we actually don't have uh, too many, uh, too much of a plan to uh, bring them back, and bring them into the story. But the, well, it is still open to possibilities, maybe. And um, as a bit of an untold setting, um, so I'm sure you're all familiar that uh, Liart runs the Whimsy Shop, and the setting behind it is that Belo, Liart, and their child is running the shop together in peace. So Belo would be the one procuring the items, and Liart would be the one who'd be selling it for um, for a bit of an inflated price. <laughs> mm, thank you. I think in especially Groba app, um, a lot of people love the couple of... Um, Vanilla and Dario, I think so. And also Omachi. Omachi is very cute and stunning. I love her also. So thank you, Noguchi-san. So let's look at our second questions. 
Um, question is Ashes of the Apocalypse is great so far. Is the Ashen King is source of the Dark Esper or was it someone like certain Sumner he met through the timeline and CZ for the Dark Esper would be great? まず、え、so in another story, chapter three, scene four, uh, in one of the battles, the Ashen King Mont in his narrative, he comments, um, in one of these worlds, I happened to I happened upon a summoner who commanded the powers of many great espers. And this is actually a bit of a description about the dark esper world, so to speak. And this is also um, something that's illustrated in um, the flavor text for the dark esper uh, vision cards. So uh, please do uh, have a look at them when you have time. ま、その so simply put, um, the settings for, for the world of the Dark Aspers is that um, a summoner would be a, would attempt to save the world that's destructing as it was nearing its the end of its lifespan, but mankind would fight over their powers for their own good, or that um, such powers of the summoner would be feared among mankind who would uh, further spe speak ill of the, them, calling them the Dark Lord, which um, ultimately led the, the led the world into destruction after all. And um, this is something that... This world, so to speak, is something that um, the that um, Ashen King Bond was also uh, living in. So that's essentially one of the sources of uh, despair in mankind that he had that we uh, that we witnessed in Chapter Three. Hi. Yeah, no, you know, story no, story no, story no, story yeah, it was very interesting to hear all these stories. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I was very much, um, I, I would love to hear more. Um, and um, I'm sure Noguchi san would have wanted to speak more on this. Yeah, really, so having um so it was great to be able to share so much so much of the behind the scenes stories, but um and um as um another story chapter three is um heading towards its end, um we would we would like for all our audiences to uh, you know stay tuned and um do um you know watch through it until the end. Saigu so yes, once again, I would love for everyone to uh, um, keep their eyes um, posted for another story, but um, it's not just another story, but also the main scenario. It is probably um, probably about midway through um, getting um, closer to the latter half so um that too i'm sure um everyone's getting um excited over and uh i would like for everyone to look forward to that as well okay this concludes the section thank you uh it was pretty wrong <laughs> section but thank you everybody for your patience and also thank you very much noguchi-san 
Thank you. Thank you, Noguchi-san. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so I think everybody <laughs> waiting too long for this. We will continue on to latest application information, update information part two. So Hiroki san, please take away. Hi. So, okay, then, ah, no, 今回の、えー、グローバルアップ4周年ではそのねたくさんのイベントを用意しております。So for our global up fourth anniversary, we certainly have many events prepared. はい、その前にですね。グローバルアップ4周年にあたってキーピアを用意しましたのでぜひ皆さんに見ていただきたいなと思います。But before going into that, we actually prepared a special key visual for the global up fourth anniversary that we'd like to share with you. Take a look. はい。うん、stunning。うん。はいというわけでね、あのこちらがキービジュアルになります。So this is the key visual. And upon reaching the target for the viewership limit break campaign we mentioned earlier, we will give away a PC wallpaper with, the, with this group of our post anniversary key visual. はい。ね、皆さん、いかがですか、これ。あの、これね、あのテーマなんですけど、まあ、4月はね、日本はこう春なんですね。なので、この春をテーマに、えー、作成しました。So, yeah, how is it, everyone?、Um, how, how's everyone liking it?、Um, in Japan, April is、um, based,、um, the month for spring. So,、um, that's why we actually、um, used、uh, spring as the main theme for this、uh, key visual. Well, I'm going to comment on the comments. I'm going to go to 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 the c o Um, seeing the、uh, comments already,、um, I'm sure、uh, it's、um, very nice to see that everyone's、um, uh, every, uh, very happy to see the <laughs> see this key visual. And、um, you know, it was worthwhile for us to create this if that's the kind of response that we're getting from you. So,、uh, thank you. Hi. So, you are going to go to the next one. So, this isn't done yet.、Uh, we do have something else coming up. So,、okay. let's look at the next one. Yeah, please take a look at this video. I like spring. The caress of the breeze is like none other. Moments of peace like these are meant to be enjoyed. Come now, this spring wind dance is for you. This'll hurt. May this protect you. A springtime storm. Yes! Just! Come, oh storm of spring! Gust and whirl! A small. Yay! Yay! Hi, I'm going to ask you this. Global Up 4 Shunen Kinen Unit. えー、春の女神ジュームがワールドワイドで4月1日から登場します。So,、um, the Global Up 4th anniversary, so, 4th anniversary Celebration Unit, Joom the Spring Celestial, will appear worldwide starting April 1st. Yeah, April 1st. Yeah. <笑><笑>だからエあ別にあの、エプリルフールの嘘じゃないですからね。ご安心ください。And rest assured, this is not an April Fool's. This is not an early April Fool's. It is happening. Yeah, I know. 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 I k So, then, Justin, can you share with us more details about her? Of course, I would be happy to. So, let's take a look here.、Uh, Hiroki stole my joke, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs>、um, all right, so we've got Joom the Spring Celestial. He is a cost 100 UR, of course, water type unit. Her weapon type is a great sword. And her main job is Shining Blossom Blade. She's very nice,、uh, very good looking. But you guys want to know some more details here, so let's get into that. 
Uh, this job is a Vanguard Striker class. It's a job that has both an ability that can attack up to two targets after removing their buffs, as well as one that can bestow courage while reducing magic damage, making it suited for both offense and defense. You guys saw her at Limit Burst in the video, but let's take a look at it again here. So her Limit Burst is Springtide Tempest. This removes physical damage reduction for wider area attack and lowers all elemental resistance for three turns of targets within range and then deals damage XL. See there, some XL damage. Very nice looking. All right, we'll, let, we'll watch it again here so everybody can soak it in. Green Tide Tempest. All right, and moving on to her next ability here. We've got... Full Bloom Prayer. This bestows magic damage reduction and raises unit attack resistance and bestows debuff effect, uh, which Courage removes ceiling for three turns to successful attacks of allies within an area around self for four turns and will survive fatal damage to self one time and additional effect raises slash magic attack resistance and lowers AP consumption while Courage is in effect and recovers AP. <laughs> So there's a lot of ands there. There's a lot going on with that buff. So rewind it if you have to. But we're going to be moving on to the next ability here, which is Bring Storm. This is also an EX ability. So this raises own slash resist piercing rate for three turns and lowers a set percentage of area attack resistance of targets within range for three turns, then deals damage large and lowers magic attack resistance piercing rate and healing power for three turns. All right, a lot of information there, I know. <laughs> um, but we got a little bit more to go through here. So let's take a look here. So next up, uh, we've got her vision card. So this is going to be um, available. Um, it's going to be uh, distributed to everybody here that you can see the shards will be distributed. So we've got the part ability here, which is critical damage up and the party ability requests which is beast killer up and the bestowed effect is acquired jp up and the vision mastery is for quests and that provides jp acquisition plus 25 and slash attack plus three so some very good stuff there uh, as i mentioned the vision card and all of the shards will be distributed so please look forward to that they will be sent directly to the present boxes upon logging in um so yeah look forward to that Get a nice card with Lucio and June there on the front. Next up, we've got her weapon here. So this is going to be the Nascent Greatsword. This is, of course, a greatsword, as you can tell. Um, and this will provide defense piercing rate up. And the limited additional abilities for June the Spring Celestial, June and Greatsword Job Soldier, Nightblade, Great Knight, provides accuracy up magic damage reduction when HP is 70% or above. So yeah, some very good information there. So look forward to that weapon. Um, just one more thing here that we wanted to cover. So we've got the training campaigns. This is for Joom. Um, you can see the information here on the screen. April 1st to April 16th, you'll be able to get barracks. Um, Joom is going to be half acquisition time during that time period um june the spring celestial jp times five camp uh, general shop unit shards guaranteed campaign and then finally here we've got june the spring celestial unit hard west item tr drop triple up campaign so a lot of shards to be had from the hard quest so look forward to that so yes that is june the spring celestial thank you justin thank you of course hi というわけでね、あのー、今回、今、まあ、ジャスティンに説明してもらいましたが、まあ、これ以外にもですね、実は今回、斜めの方でさらにね、とっておきのものを用意したということですね。So I realized Justin just went over quite a lot of, a lot of information there, but I actually heard Nanami has something up her sleeve、uh, today too. Yes?、Mm -hmm. That's right. That I would like to share the design draft of June the Spring Celestial, which is not even in the art book. Oh. And um, Hiroki san, can you share with us the concept behind the production of the Jum in Spring Celestial? Hi, so this is the global one of the 1 key to 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 the 1 
、まあ、今の時期とね、合わせて春の訪れで、まあ、陽気が、陽気な、その春の陽気がね、おこう溢れるような風,風景、あとはまあプレイヤーとまあお祝いとか、感謝の気持ち、分け合うみたいなことをテーマにして作りました。So, as this unit was the winner of the、um, unit popularity poll for the global、uh, version back then, and、um, considering that this is in line with、uh, this time of the year when spring is on its way, so、uh, her theme was to share a sense of spring's arrival with a cheerful backdrop as well as a, a feeling of celebration and gratitude for our players. So, as a veteran warrior, she usually has this very cool and stoic uh, uh, composure, but、um, we wanted to show a bit of a gentle side to her.、ねね、so, she usually has this very c o o So, I did notice in, the, in、uh, some of the comments that、uh, you know, some folks were saying、uh, Jume is smiling. And so,、um, this is, that's exactly something that we wanted to show、uh, with a bit of a gentle and、uh, more cheerful、uh, you know, side of her.、Mm, thank you. Thank you. Yoroki san. Jume the Spring Celestial Global. global <coughs> Jume the Spring Celestial Global up for fourth anniversary unit for. Will be introduced for a while from April 1st. We won't be sure to get her. Next, let's talk about the campaign for our fourth anniversary. Not only do we have an anniversary unit, but we also have a lot of campaigns stored. Hi. Yeah, I know. 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 Yeah, so again, I'm seeing a lot of comments saying that、um, they're very happy to see Jim. And,、um, you know,、uh, seeing that,、um, again, it was very much worthwhile for us to、uh, create her. So、um, uh, thank you very much for the feedback. Hi, to you again, the campaign no show care of state of my mass. Global Mone, Yon Shune, Mukaite, Minasan, you know, Higor no Kansha, or Comete, Madu, Tatsu no Medama campaign, or Shoka state of my mass. So, yes, let's move right on to the campaigns.、Um, So, as the, fourth, as the global app Max, marks its fourth anniversary, it's, sorry, yeah, the interpreter son is a little bit,、um, she, she's getting a little bit tired. No, pardon me. That's, sorry. So, as the global app marks it, its first, fourth anniversary, and to show our appreciation, we, I want to first、um, talk about the two featured campaigns. Hi. Eh, So, the first item on the list is the fourth anniversary Give Back Festival. Hi. So, the first item on the list is the fourth anniversary Give Back Festival. Hi. So, the first item on the list is the fourth anniversary Give Back Festival. Hi. So, the first item on the list is the fourth anniversary Give Back Festival. Hi. So, the first item on the list is the fourth anniversary Give Back Festival. So, this is a campaign where、um, for every 2000 visitors that you have spent at the shop during the period from the release of this app until April 9th, we will distribute, we will distribu- distribute one summon ticket. Again,、wow. this is、uh, for every 2000 visitors that you have spent in the shop. Hi. そして2つ目、えー、4周年記念最大の最大400連分無料召喚です。And up next, we have the fourth anniversary special up to 400 times free summons. はい。この400回っていうのがどういう内容かっていうのをちょっと説明させていただきます。And allow me to go into a little bit more detail as to、um, what this 400 um, entails. まず、えっ、ー、とですね、まずは1回限定の UR。10枠確定の無料100連勝か。So first, we actually have a 10 UR guaranteed one time only free 100 times summon. はい。こちらがですね、4月の1日から4月の30日までということになっております。And this will be available from April 1st through the end of the month, April 30th. はい。そしてもう一つがですね。Up next. 
1月あ、1日1回限定の無料10連勝館を30日分で最大300回勝、えー、300連勝館になります。So, next part of it is that、um, you get a free 10 times summon once a day, every day for 30 days, which gives you a maximum of 300、uh, free summons.、はい、こちらも、ね、期間はその4月の1日から4月の30日のまさに30日間に毎日、えー、できます。This too will be running from the 1st of April throughout the month until the 30th.、はい、ということで、ね、その先ほどの、えー、無料の100連勝館、1回限定 UR10 話確定の無料召喚の100回100連召喚と、今回のここに見えている300連、最大300連召喚、合わせて最大で400連分の無料召喚になります。So when you add up the total, so you get, so you get that 300 summons from、um, the daily free、uh, 10 times summon, and、um, on top of that, you get that one time only 100 summon with、um, the Uh, 10UR、uh, guarantees, which gives you a total of 400. なのでね、皆さんね、ぜひこの期間、お,お忘れなく、もう、召喚を回して、あ召喚をぜひしてください。ね、so,、um, just a reminder that everyone will be logging in every day, just and make sure you don't, you don't forget to、uh, pull the summons every day. はい、えー。続きまして、他のキャンペーンもあります。なのでジャスティンね、ぜひちょっと、えー、紹介お願いします。And as far as the rest of the campaigns are concerned, there's still a lot going on, so let's have Justin take that away. Oh, well,、uh, all right then. Let's take a look here. So, next up, we've got the fourth anniversary login bonus. This is going to be available from April 1st until April 9th. You'll be able to log in during the event period and pick up some awesome rewards, so be sure to do that every single day. But as a special treat for the fourth anniversary, Players can get a 10 times summon ticket on the first day of the login bonus period. This summon ticket can be used for June the Spring Celestial、uh, featured summons. So, log in, use that first before you do anything else there. <laughs>、um, <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of other stuff. There's a lot of shards. You see old Doa shards in there as well.、Um, some Vizior and some、uh, Visigenic. Not a Visigenic antler.、So. Uh, scroll of Vicissitude. That's what I meant to say. Anyway, moving on here. Uh, we've got the other campaigns that are going to be running、um, and a limited time arena as well. So, the training challenge missions to celebrate the release of Strategist Old Doa and the training challenge missions to celebrate the release of Joom the Spring Celestial.、Um, unit, har- unit Hard Quest Item Drop Quadruple Campaign. So, look forward to that. A lot of shards to be had there. And the Strategist Old Doa in Joom the Spring Celestial Barracks. Unit Shard Acquisition Halftime Campaign. They'll get both of those units into the barracks, please.、Um, you can also see there's going to be another limited arena coming up. You'll be able to mock battle from the、uh, 15th to the 16th, and then you can see the time for the main battles there on the screen. Pick up some wonderful titles there. All right, so yes, that is what we have for the Global App Fourth Anniversary Campaign. So be sure to log in. There's a lot of stuff going on, and pick it up while you can. Thank you, Justin. ね、あの今回、ね、この無,こう無料の,、えー、確定のあ UR 確定の召喚などもありますしね、ぜひこの機会にお友達などを誘ってですね、新しくプレイヤーを、ね、始める人もどんどん増えてもらえるといいなと思ってます。Yeah, so、um, as I mentioned earlier, there is that free、um, you, uh, 10UR guaranteed 100 summons, and、um, this probably would be a perfect opportunity to bring in some of your friends into the game too. So、um, do encourage your friends who haven't already started the game to、uh, join in at this time.、Mm-hmm. Thank you, Justin h i o k i And this concludes our latest update news part two segment. Yeah. So yes, thank let's. You. Thank you. Now, as some of you. May already know we announced the winner of the, our fourth anniversary design contest two weeks ago. I think the live stream is a perfect opportunity to recap the winner with everyone. Hi, Hontoy, ne, ano, taksan no, gobo. Arigato gozaimashita. Yeah,、um, thank you very much for,、uh, to everyone who submitted their, your, your, your、uh, illustrations. Ano, Hontoy, ne, Hontoy, worldwide, de, ne, ano, boshu, o, shita, no, de, 本当にね、もう日本も合わせて、世界中の方から、皆さんからたくさん素敵な作品を、えー、いただきました。本当にありがとうございます。And、um, for, this, for this contest, we accepted a 
we accepted submissions from literally uh, worldwide. So we were getting amazing uh, submissions from not just from Japan, but from around the world. So once again, thank you very much for your participation. 結構ね、そのね、送られ日本もそうですし、日本以外、アメリカ、北米もそうですし、まあ他のアジアの国、まあ、あとヨーロッパの国、まあ、いろんなね、皆さんの絵が微妙にまたその、その地域地域のこう特徴なんかがあってね、すごく面白かったです。It was interesting because、um, it's not just Japan, but from the States, Asia, Europe, there's, there were a lot of submissions from around the world. And、um, a lot of those works were very much reflective of、um, where they came from, too, which is very interesting to see. Okay, let's get right into it. So, can we have the slide with the result? Of course.、Mm-hmm. Okay, these seven illustrations are the winner of the design contest. Congratulations. Congratulations. Now let's recap the grand prize winner. Let's see the slides for it. はい。ね、これあの、今回ね、こう、大賞を受賞したのこのマミーさんの絵になります。本当におめでとうございます。So the grand prize winner is、uh, Mami.、Uh, thank,、um, uh, congratulations. あのこれら辺の,あのこういった絵の、まあ、実際に詳細はですねあの特設サイトがありますのでそちらで、えー、見ることができますのでねぜひ興味を持った方はそちらもぜひ見てください。So、um, as far as the、uh, for you to、um, check out the actual works and、uh, comments that's pertaining to it,、um, there is a dedicated website for this. So、um, if, you have to, if you have time to do that, please take a look. ねすごいこうコミックみたいな感じでね動きがあってすごいカラフルで楽しい絵ですよね。Yeah,、um, what I like about it is that、um, it was very vibrant,、um, a very、uh, comic like art style、um, with、um, a lot of、uh, action going on too. So,、uh, um, yeah. Okay, thank you. And next we have a runner up illustration. Let's see it. Hi, to you, the Yushu Show, Jushu Stanwa, Pomeko san, this is me. Pomeko goes I'm ass. So, the runner up winner is Pomeko.、Uh, congratulations. <laughs> はい、でこれ今、あのー、ここに今、スライドに出てるアーティストの名前が日本語になっていますが、これ、ポメコと書いてあります。So, um, I realized that the slide is showing the Japanese script for her name, but this is read as ポメコ。<笑><笑>はい。もうね、やっぱ構図いいですよね、やっぱしね。I quite like how the, the layout of this,、uh, the characters are in, in this、uh, illustration. 僕、このこれ、コメントを書いているんですけど、本当にその一つの絵の中にね、いろんな意味が入ってるっていうのがね、すごい素晴らしいなと思いました。ぜひこれも特設サイトでね、見てもらえればなと思います。I was actually the one who wrote this、uh, comment, but、um, again,、um, I like the fact that a lot of things were going on in this、um, illustration. So,、um, for, the, for more detailed look in this illustration and also the comment,、uh, again, please check out the dedicated website. Okay, thank you and congratulations, Pomiko san. And... Here are the standout design winners.、えーえー、はい、というわけで、佳作に、佳作に入った方は、えー、おわたちさん、岩わこふさん、えー、アウトランニングさん、おび、おびん、おびにくさん、ワイトゥエルさんの以上、ごめん、になります。おめでとうございます。So the five winners of the standout design or おわたち、いわこふ、アウトリングライジング、Um, Ovenix and Y2L.、Uh, once again, congratulations. Hi. Ne, Kormo ne, Ko, Ma, Nihon no artist no Katam, Kaitu Grasata, Irasto, Kaitu Grasata Katam Irushi, Ato ne, and the Global de Kaitu Grasata Katam Irushi, the Katam, Iroda na Ko, Kunikara, Yatikita, Irasto ni Nimas. Again,、um, the, um, the winners are not just from Japan, but also from、um, also the、um, users from around the world, too. So,、um, again,、um, very interesting to see them. <laughs> 微妙にね、この絵のタッチのがちょっと違ったりするところもちょっと面白いですよね。And it's very that, um, how there's, uh, different art styles or uh, different uh, feels to it. So... ね、他にもね、本当にたくさんの方々がね、あのー、イラストを作ってくださったので、本当にありがとうございました。改めてまたお礼を植えつけていただきたいと思います。And、um, again, there were、um, many more than this that have been entered into the contest too. So once again, thank you very much for your participation. Mm, thank you, Hiroki san. Other than the Rina illustration we just talked about, there were many more re- really great illustrations as well. 
So today in this live stream, we would like to showcase what other illustrations were submitted. Among the illustrations submitted by our global players, Hiroxin and Justin and I would like to share our personal favorite. Mm. Please note that we are just going to share the illustration we like personally, so there will be no reward. Let's start with me first. Here's my favorite. <laughs> there we go. Oh. Okay, thank you. And this is my favorite painting, I think. Yes. Um, the theme theme <laughs> was Phoebe. I think it so it immediately caught my eye because um they uh he or she drew the unit that has been the game since the release. It was pretty um old unit, I think. And the touch is very soft because it is watercolor paint painting and the colors are gentle and I personally like it because it has healing element. I also got impression of Pini BB in a from her facial expression. <laughs> Sorry. I also <laughs> felt a lot of love for the fact that they painted their restoration in traditional way and while most of, of the illustrations are digitally created, created and detail of, of covering her outfit and clocks, I think, in the background blew me away. ね、なんかね、あの、イラストをね、すごく綺麗ですけど、なんかその後ろにあるこうパレット、絵の具のパレットとか筆とかね、まあその辺の風景でこの写真そのものがなんかね、一つの作品みたいに見えて、すごくい
made a very complex piece of art and it's <laughs> easy to draw one or two characters. No, I'm not going to say it's easy. It's a <laughs> lot more difficult to draw a lot of these characters in a lot of these poses doing a lot of different things. Um, so I, I just wanted to commend the artist for um, really stepping out there and doing something very complex and doing something very big. Um, I think it's very nice that everybody is sort of um, being, you know, in the in the art at the same time. Um, and everybody is just sort of hanging out together. And you've got some a lot of Final Fantasy sort of themes going on here as well. Anyway, um, I can't say anything quite as profound or nice as... The other two have said but anyway i just wanted to commend the artist um, for taking on such a challenging piece of art and really stepping out there and uh, trying their best to make something that is very nice so i wanted to give props to the artist um, so yes thank you very much for submitting this and it looks very nice yeah, as Justin just mentioned, um, you know, each of the characters are standing out on its own and, um, you know, it's all, it almost kind of gives you the impression that it's a, it's kind of like, you know, vision card ask if we made that. And so, yeah, it's very nice. <laughs> and I quite like the very cute moguls right there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ね、yeah, so factually speaking, there were quite a lot of submissions from our global players alone and, um, you know, ranging from hand-drawn to more digital. Um, from each and every one of them, we felt the love for uh, World of the Vision. So again, I'm very grateful that, um, and as a matter of fact, um, we're grateful that some people even submitted uh, multiple um, illustrations too. So again, I can't thank everyone enough. We can't thank you enough for submitting the illustration, everyone. So thank you for your continued support. So that's wrap up for the post anniversary design contest segment. So now let's move on to the next segment. And I don't know if it's just me, but I'm in a bit of creation mode <laughs> mood from seeing all of all of those amazing restorations. Don't you agree, Hiroki-san? Hi, <laughs> Tashikane. <laughs> あの、ま、以前にね、ナナミとピクチャーゲームをやったことありますけども、ま、その時のね、ナナミの画力っていうのはね、今でもちょっと覚えてますよ。Well, uh, yes, of course. Um, and um, as a matter of fact, I remember you and I did a mini game involving drawings uh, um, in a previous live stream and um, you know, but I still remember your drawing abilities from back then, right? <laughs> so, I mean, you guys remember too, right? <laughs> So I'm eating to show my drawing chops again. So today I have a werewolf drawing game in store for everyone. Yeah, so this is actually an opportunity for um our audiences to um, you know, um earn an item or to be more exact have his yours. So um yes. But uh, does everyone know what a werewolf game is? Yes. Does everybody know what a werewolf game is? Maybe not. I <laughs> wasn't too familiar with it by name, so please allow me the opportunity here to explain it pretty briefly, um, just so you guys can get the idea and see what we're going to be doing here. Uh, so, first of all, uh, werewolf is a game to identify who the wolf is among the villagers. So one of us three, Hiroki-san, Nanami-san, or me, will be the wolf, and we will draw a picture, and everybody will try to figure out which one of us three is the wolf. So those who are not the wolf, those who are not the wolf, are normal villagers who will perform the tasks of completing a drawing, and um, there are going to be three envelopes with information on what to draw. One of these envelopes uh, only have the information on what to draw. The other one is blank. So two of the envelopes have information on what to draw, and the third one is going to be blank. 
So in other words, the person who draws a blank piece of paper is the wolf and must draw a picture without letting others know that they are the wolf. <laughs> we haven't drawn yet, so people don't make any guesses yet. Anyway, so after picking an envelope one by one and confirming what is inside, the three of us will take turns drawing one stroke at a time on a whiteboard on the screen to complete the drawing. Uh, once all three of us have taken some turns to draw our stroke, it will be counted as one round and we will have two rounds to complete the drawing. So we'll draw once, that's the end of a round, we'll draw again, that's the end of the second round. Um, so yeah, everybody's goal is to figure out who the wolf is. They're, you know, gonna be pretending to know what to draw alongside the other two, but they actually have no idea what to do. So that's the idea of the game. <laughs> yeah, I hope everybody <laughs> understands the game. But we will play this game once and we will give everyone 1,000 visual war if you figure out who is a wolf is. Mm. So it's not just our drawing abilities, but perhaps our acting ability if we may. That's probably another crucial point in um in uh in this game. Uh yeah, that's definitely true. So um, you know, even if I'm the wolf, I have to deceive everyone so that no one figures out that I'm the wolf. Um but we'll see. You know, we'll see how it goes. Um, so I guess maybe we should choose the envelopes now. I think I saw you holding, somebody holding them up. Oh. Mm. I have, so... I have one, two, three envelopes. So put, Justin, please choose one of these. Um, hmm. uh, I'm going to pick number three. Three? Yes. Mm. Got it. So I just tossed the dev team and... Three, two, one. Three, uh, three. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> three. <laughs> so, Hiroki san, which one you choose? The one. Okay. So, I'm gonna be two. Now, ne, ano, Justin got the three band of the band. Our staff got the data. Now, Justin's side is sending it to me. So, um, you saw that Justin chose number three, um, which um, our lovely staff member is uh, relaying information about what's inside the envelope yes. um, to Justin as we speak so that he knows whether if he's it or not. So, we also know what's inside the envelope or 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 what's inside the So, we're doing this for real. No one knows what's inside the, con what's inside the envelope in advance. So, um, and seeing that the re information has been relayed over to Justin. Okay, Justin. So, I just took a look at it. Mm -hmm. okay. You okay? I have my acting okay. skills yeah. on here. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna see what's inside. Uh, okay. <laughs> I checked. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So, Hiroki san, Justin, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. So, we will draw in the order base on the number of envelopes we choose, starting with the person who envelope number one. I think Hiroki san. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, we will have to turn to draw. So, everyone make sure to pay close attention to our every move to figure out who is the big bad wolf is. So I think Hiroki and me and Justin. Hmm. So yes, I will can be you stop? Can you start to <laughs> draw? All right, so hopefully it shows up here on the screen here in a moment. Hiroki's mm -hmm. first here. Okay, I pass. Yeah, I right. Uh... <笑> okay. あ、これね、今ね、あれなの、あの、マウスで書いてるから、ちょっとね、書きにくいです。You'll have to excuse us、um, if it looks a little awkward because、uh, we only have a mouse to draw with. <笑><笑> okay. Done? Right now? Yeah, done. I'm done.、Okay. So that's my turn. I think I can do better than last time. Okay, okay. 
Oh. There's a delay. Oh, on okay, our okay. Screen, so. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. So Justin, your turn now. Um. Okay. Here, let me think. Oh. <laughs> I only get one stroke. Okay, I let go. So yeah, one stroke. That's okay. My stroke. So, second turn again, Hiroki. My turn. Let's okay. Go for it. He... One draw. One draw. One stroke. One stroke. Mm. Mm. Like, everybody, no idea what's okay. going on. <laughs> Okay, I think. A little delay? Okay. We have a delay, so we have yeah. to wait for a moment. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, uh, what should I write? Uh... <laughs> Ore, ne, ima, nanda ka wakaru kana? Comment, ano, miter mina san. Nanda ka, nanda ka wakarimasu? So does the is the audience getting a hint as to what this may be by any chance? Um, I'll see if there's any uh, comments there. Um... <laughs> oh, Ima ne Nanami ga kaite mas. And uh, yeah, Nanami is uh, currently uh, doing her stroke right now. He's concentrating very hard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing that uh, there's some predictions coming from our audience. So this is my last turn, so I will write a lot of it. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm seeing that there's a lot of predictions coming from our uh, players. Okay, here we go. It's loading now. Oh? Oh. Oh. Mm. seeing a lot of uh, folks uh, mentioning Mogul, but um, you know, when, when you think about it, Mogul doesn't exactly have um, this much uh, hair, right? But <laughs> well, you know, maybe she's just making up a bunch of stuff because she is, in fact, a wolf. Who knows? <laughs> I mean, okay, it is a single stroke. She hasn't, uh, you know, she she hasn't uh, taken her finger off the mouse. So, I mean, it is one, it is technically speaking, one stroke. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Did it finish? Okay. finish? Yeah, we finished. Okay. Okay, now it's yeah, my turn. Yeah, just in town. Yeah. Okay. Oh. A lot, of, a lot of people say like June. Mm. It's not gonna oh, happen. Oh, June. <laughs> <laughs> June mm. isn't that hairy. Mm. <laughs> um. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, no. Mm. Uh, uh, ochu, yeah? mm, 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 mm. Okay, I finished. Mm. Mm. Oh, Nan, on the monster, I must have. Do we even have a monster that looks like the subtle? Do we? <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's uh, okay, so one of us is a wolf who didn't know what we are supposed to draw. So what do you think of this is? 
So please answer the poll in the chat. I think it's going to be pop up. Yeah, there's going to be a survey that pops up on YouTube. So um, you can vote on that when it pops up. It might, I'm not, I don't know if it'll be on Twitch or not. We'll see. ね、これね、2人は何のモンスターを描くかっていうのは分かってて描いていて、1人だけ何にも知らないで描いてるっていう状況ですね。So just a reminder that,、um, so out of the three of us,、um, two, two of us knew what we were drawing, one of us didn't, and you need to guess who didn't know what was going on. <笑>これもさ、3人とも何,の何を描いてるか知らない可能性すらあるよ。But who knows? Maybe none of us actually knew what we were doing. <笑> Oh. Um, I voted for somebody else. Am I allowed to do that?、Mm. <laughs> I... <laughs> uh, I've been looking for a comment. Maybe Justin. Your,、mm. your answer is Justin. I don't know.、Mm. No. I don't know. Nanami? <laughs> <laughs> so. Okay. We just gotta、okay. wait for it to finish here before we. It finished. I think it's finished.、Mm -hmm. Oh, it did? It finished? So, everyone thinks、uh, everyone t h i n k Justin in the result? <laughs> Me? Oh. So, okay, so are you actually a wolf, Justin? No. Oh. oh. <laughs> I am not. Okay. Te koto wa, boku ka, nanami no dochi ka ga, ko, kotai o shirazu ni kaite ta te koto desu ne. So that means that either myself, Hiroki, or Nanami was the one who was clueless as to what was going on. <laughs> so, everyone, you only have one more chance to get it right. So, one of two is the wolf. So, think hard and choose again. So, I think the poll will pop up. So, wait for it. Uh, So it seems like we've got the poll back up again. <laughs> yeah, but the fact that I'm going to be able to do it, I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. I'm going to be able to do it. So looking at、um, our behaviors, if we may,、um, you know. One of, so, again, one of us were drawing without a clue. And I mean, you know, there was someone who was drawing quite a lot as if they knew what they were doing. <laughs> But he only draw like eyes. I think he, like, he's sus. Sus. <laughs> 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 But you do realize that, you know, what was seemingly like a mogul,、um, you know, someone, a particular someone was drawing a lot of hair on them, right? So I wonder what that may be. Ah, yeah, but yeah,、um, who knows who was the actual <laughs> one who was clueless as to what they were drawing? Or what they were supposed to draw, if we may.、Mm. Oh, oh, that poll is over, and the, everyone thinks Hiroki is a wolf. So, are you actually that wolf, Hiroki? <laughs> <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm a wolf.、Um. <laughs> yeah, my, my end of the wolf. My envelope is nothing. But anyway, I don't know. So, what exactly was that? It was Omachi <laughs> from another story.、Um, I'm showing. Then, then, I don't know. 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 I don't know.
I had uh, right. Hiroki actually had no idea what he was actually supposed to be, but well, there you have it. <laughs> okay. I think it's all true. Mm -hmm. But another, is that another story? Uh, oh. 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 Okay. okay. <laughs> it, apologies for the technical difficulty <laughs> right there, but um, well, it, it just shows that we were going live. So um, yeah. いや、あの、じゃあでもさ、俺全く全く最初一番最初に何も分からずにただ丸を書いたんだけど、意外に合ってたね。So, again, I was very much clueless as to what I was actually supposed to draw. So, I just um I drew a generic circle, but I actually but then I guess that turned out to be something that was um okay. いや、でもね、皆さん本当見事でした。but um, everyone did an excellent job in um, finding out who it was. <laughs> Congratulations. Um, I would like to defend myself here. Um, I drew a... Okay, so Hiroki drew a circle. Mm -hmm. I thought mm -hmm. for sure that was uh, Ochu. I thought mm -hmm. Nanami was the wolf when Hiroki mm -hmm. drew the circle. Um, oh. But I drew, I drew the whiskers. Like, mm -hmm. people are saying uh, I can't draw, but the whiskers are very, very, very clear. And it's obvious <laughs> that I knew what I was doing. <laughs> I think the color of a pen was big hint. Because for my color was green, so mm. I was just drawing the flowers <laughs> or green. <laughs> so I I hope everybody know that that is Ochu. <laughs> Omachi. But then when you think about it, Justin, um, um you know, everyone was doubting that um you know everyone was thinking that uh Justin, you were the wolf initially. So <laughs> Yes. So everybody, you're amazing. Since everybody was successful in figuring out who is the wolf is, the player will be rewarded with 100 with your... 1,000. 1,000, yeah. 1,000 with your. <laughs> so that concludes our mini game segment. So lastly, let's talk about the Roman moving forward. Hiroki-san, please take away. Hi. もちろんですね。はい。じゃあ本日のね、え、トピックスとして、え、グローバルアップ4周年関連情報とキャンペーンを発表させていただきましたが、え、もう少し先の予定も気になるというプレイヤーの皆さんも多いと思っています。So yes, for sure, Nanami. Um, so in the slide stream, um, up until now, we've covered a lot of news and campaigns related to the fourth anniversary of the global app, and um, but still, I believe many of the players are wondering what's to come um after that. So um, as you can see, we have we would like to share our roadmap for April. はい。ね、今ね、出てるのがその4月のロードマップになるんですが、はい。and so, yes, what you're seeing is the roadmap for April. はい。ね、本日ね、あの、こうご紹介させていただいたキャラクターたちは4月の1日に登場します。so you will see that the units that we have introduced um, during the stream will be appearing in the first week of April. And um, you'll also see that um, in uh, weeks three and four, we will have an additional unit coming up as well. はい。で、4月はですね、あのこの4月1日、4月1日1週目だけが月曜日の更新になります。and um, as far as when the DLCs will be coming in, um, April 1st, the month, uh, that's the only uh, time that we will have an update coming on a Monday. はい。で、以降は2週目、3週目、4週目に関しては水曜日の更新になりますので、え、そちらね、え、ご承知をください。and thereafter following um so in weeks two three and four um the updates will be happening on Wednesdays. So please make note of that. Hi. Okay. Right. So thank you, Hiroki and I. I am very excited for mm -hmm. April as it marks the fourth anniversary for the Global App. So we are nearing the end of the stream, but Hiroki-san, of course, you haven't forgotten about you know what, have you? Yes, of course. 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 So of course I haven't forgotten. Um, and so now I would like to talk about the details of the live stream present that um all of you have been waiting for. Please take a look. Hi, 
、えー、これはですね先ほどの,あのミニゲームで手に入れたあの100美女も100じゃないです1000美女もあの入れての、えー、数になります So, the,、um, the, the amount of visitors that you're seeing here does include the minigame rewards. So, the additional, so the 1000 visitors that, we, that、um, you have just earned yourselves. Visual is 4444 years old. It's 4 years old. And、um, of course, to commemorate the fourth、um, anniversary,、um, we have、uh, prepared for you 4444 visitors. And then, a few years ago, we have seen. あのここにあるのたくさん、まあ、このいらあの1枚じゃ収,収まりきらないぐらいいろいろご用意しましたのでぜひねこちらでゲームを楽しんでください。And、um, as, you, as you saw, that、um, our、um, presents have extended over to、um, two slides.、Um, we have a lot in the store for you, and so、um, hopefully you'll be able to utilize all of this in the game. So、uh, please do keep enjoying the game with all these rewards. Yes, everybody, be sure to log in. And thank you very much, Hiroki san, for the、yeah. rewards. <laughs> okay, we are also running a special viewership campaign for this live stream. If the total number of views of the live stream is archived, exceed 5,000 as of March 31st, all players will be awarded with the Global a c f o r c e University PC wallpaper. So, we urge everyone who is watching this live stream to share the live stream with your friends. Hi. まあ、さらにですね、えーこんえー、今、公式 SNS でグローバルアップ4周年記念カウントダウンキャンペーンも実施中です。And also, in addition,、uh, the Global Up 4th Anniversary Countdown campaign is happening on our、uh, social media. And the details of it will be listed on our、uh, official social media accounts, so please, please be sure to check them out. Okay, thank you. So, this is the end of the live stream for today. Ah, mm. Okay, I will wait. The f i g h t is gone. <laughs>、yeah. This、right. is the content campaign.、Mm. And then this is the end of the live stream for today.、Um, thank you for seeing our live fourth anniversary live stream. It was pretty long, it f e e l almost two hours. So thank、yes. you for your、um, thank you for to see and watch、um, you, uh, live stream today. And I hope、uh, it's going to be fifth or sixth anniversary for WTV FFB. So thank you, everyone. So, can I have a comment from Justin first? Oh, sure. I will give a comment.、Um, don't really have anything super prepared here, but、um, I just wanted to say thank you, everybody, for tuning in today and watching our live stream.、Um, it's kind of weird and it's kind of great that it's been four of these already.、Um, Or three? I'm not sure. I, I, I can't <laughs> do math right now. Anyway,、um, it's been several of these already. So thank you very much, everybody, for tuning in today.、Um, and thank you, everybody, that continues to be a part of the community.、Um, as you know, I'm the community manager, so I see a lot of details and information and stuff that is posted.、Um, so,、uh, you know, a while back we had the、uh, awards that we gave out to the pillars of support and stuff like that. Um, so, thank you very much to everybody on, on that side that continues to make videos and continues to make this game a better place. Also, I just wanted to give just a quick shout out you know, to a lot of other people that are within the community that are giving their best and spending their time enriching the game. You know, the people that are running Discords and、uh, making YouTube videos and that are on the Reddit and just everything that everybody is doing to share information and give everybody else a better time. Thank you very much for doing that.、Uh, we appreciate it on our end. So, yeah, that's all. Happy fourth anniversary. Look forward to June. Look forward to Oldoa. And thank you very much. Thank you, Justin. Hi. Yes, I'm going to ask you to ask me. And, uh, last but, and uh, lastly, from myself. Hi.、はい、あの本当にね、あのまえー、ボアブドビジョンズ、4周年迎えることができました。本当にこれはね、プレイヤーの皆さんのおかげです。ありがとうございます。So,、um, to think that War of the Visions have、uh, reached the sports anniversary,、um, is, again, this is all because of、um, the support from all our players. So, thank you once again. まあね、本当にこう、ね、コメントもいろいろ
、生放送でいただいていますし、まあね、いろいろ温かいコメントもあれば、あのもっと、ね、こうご意見もありますし、まあ、そういった、ね、皆さんの声が、えー、我々のこのゲームを、ね、より良くしていくと思います、していってますんで。ぜひね、これからもいろいろなご意見よろしくお願いいたします。And、um, even from this live stream alone,、um, we've been receiving many comments, may it be warmer regards or、uh, feedback. And it's those comments that, will, that is、um, sort of like what, what Justin said,、um, enriching the, this、um, uh, app to、uh, make it further, make it even better. So、um, once again, thank you so much for it.4、ね、周年もいろいろあのキャンペーンもやってますし、まあ、あとね、新しいユニットも登場しますし。楽しんでいただけるものにできればなと思っておりますので、ぜひね、あのまあ、お友達とご家族、ご兄弟、皆さん誘ってですね、一緒に楽しんでもらえるといいなと思っております。So, in this fourth anniversary,、um, as you saw, there are many campaigns that are in the house. So, um, and, um... To make, and、uh, we will continue to make the, get, the game even、uh, better. So,、um, so do encourage your friends, family, siblings,、um, who have you,、um, to,、um, to start the game too and、um, you know, further, increase, further enrich this community. And last but not least,、um, thank you so much for staying with us until the end after this、um, two hour long、uh, live stream. <laughs> はい、これからもぜひね、あの、ワールドビジョンズよろしくお願いいたします。So, uh, we look forward to continue serving you for our w a r of the visions. Thank you so much. はい。そしてですね、あの、If you like the live stream, this live stream, please hit the like and subscribe to your, our, our, our channel. Leave a comment and share on social media. はい。というわけでね、本日はご視聴本当にありがとうございました。So, thank you once again for joining us in this live stream today. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. And thank you, Noguchi san, for showing up as well. <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much. Bye. Bye, Bye everybody. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.